Aloha, welcome, welcome, welcome. My name is Master Paul, and I am honored to serve you here today. Today is September 19, 2016, and today I am focusing on a brand new series. It is called 10 Days of the Ten Das. Now, the Ten Das are something that Dr. and Master Zhigong Sha has brought to humanity. The word Da is a Mandarin Chinese word and it means greatest, D-A, greatest. So today as I go deeper into the nature of the Ten Das to bring healing and balance to our life, to bring flourishing to our life, we will have a tremendous amount of value uh, associated with each of these days. I will allow the days to flesh themselves out because I'm not quite sure what heaven wants me to do in the releasing of this information. When I checked in this morning, you know, what do I do? Um, how do I do it? When do I do it? How long do I do it? You know, I always ask heaven these kinds of questions and they're always good with their answers. And in this case, it just said, just do the ten dollars, we'll guide you. So, okay, I can do that. So I want to acknowledge all the new folks that are coming in. We have uh, Kristen Rojas, Sandra Gropal, Petra Marie, staying up late with us in Europe. Scott, great to see you, Scott. Dawn Dees, Diane Wooten, thank you all, everybody, so much for your sharing. Uh, Raul, great to see you as well. Kathy Snyder, um, Amy Minago, and Yvonne has joined us. Mel Gittens, wonderful to see all of you. Thank you so much for joining me here today. It's going to be a very, very exciting uh, next 10 days because you know this is based on a very recently released book that Dr. and Master Shah has brought to humanity. Uh, it's called Soul Over Matter. I recognize it's backwards in your video, but it's called Soul Over Matter. And uh, it has received rave reviews. It reached the number one bestsellers list uh, on Amazon, on Barnes & Noble, on uh, Wall Street Journal, New York Times, pretty much everybody's list, it hit number one in multiple departments, in nonfiction, in finances, in spirituality. And so the reason it is hit such a, a peak frenzy is because of the, uh, the unique nature of the wisdom and information that is in this book. <clears throat> Dr. and Master Shah, for all those that will watch this video at some point a little later on, uh, and those that are new, uh, thank you Kristen, thank you Monica for sharing it in all your groups and anybody else, um, Cheryl, uh, everybody, I really appreciate it. Um, Dr. And Master Shah is a world-renowned healer. He is an actual doctor and he is probably the, the most humble spiritual soul I've ever met. He's written over 20 books, at least 10 of which have reached New York Times best-selling list. And the reason his books reach the best-selling list and stay there is because they speak truth. The reason they speak truth is because he doesn't write them. Master Shah's native language is, is Mandarin Chinese. So his, his knowledge of the English language is ill, uh, weak, in compared to somebody born in the Americas. Um, and so when he writes a book, he simply connects to the divine and says, you know, I'm ready, please deliver this information. And then his, uh, his um, right-hand person, Master Cynthia, types out everything as it flows out his mouth. He typically writes uh, three books, four books a year, and if you know anybody that, that can do that, well, that's what you would call a miracle. So Dr. Master Shah recently wrote this book, and uh, co-author is Adam Markell, very well-known uh, financial guru around the world. And um, Dr. Master Shah met Adam Markell at a major event in California, and uh, ever since then they've been uh, best friends. And he, he, Master Shah did, did quite a few miracle healings for Adam Markell's family. His deaf son can now hear, uh, born deaf, mind you, and now he can hear sounds again. So there's quite a few um, uh, attributes that Dr. Master Shah carries. And but number one is the understanding of soul over matter. This uh, information, even though it's the title of this book, has been stated and coming out of his mouth for well over 10 years. He speaks about the basic understanding that everyone and everything has a soul. Everything has a spark of the divine in it. That includes our finances, our relationships, 
and uh, every aspect of our life. So if we are not having flourishing, which is the nature of these 10 Das that we'll be talking about over the next 10 days, if we're not having any form of flourishing in any aspect of our life, it is because of blockages at the level of soul. Now you can see as I talk into the live stream and it's hiccuping a little bit, so I hope that balances itself out. Um, so what are the 10 Das? These again delivered to Master Shah, the connection with the Divine. And his purpose in life is to serve humanity. If you open any of his books, there's always, in front of every book, a chapter dedicated to his mission. He has three major aspects to his mission, which is to serve humanity, to empower people to heal themselves, and to empower people to reach enlightenment. And he does that through the wisdom given to him uh, by the Divine. And that includes the ten Da's. So there is Da I, greatest love. Da Quan Shu, greatest flourishing. These Da's, the Da means greatest, and then the other word is, these are Mandarin Chinese, so Da I, I is heart or love. Da I, greatest love. Da Quan Shu, greatest flourishing. Da Zi Bei, greatest compassion. Da Guang Ming, greatest light. Then you have Da Chen Bei, which is greatest, um, the greatest, uh, right on the tip of my tongue, humility, Da Chen Bei, greatest harmony, Da He She. You have greatest flourishing, which is Da Chang Sheng, Da Gan En, which is greatest gratitude. You have greatest service, Da Fu Wu, and you have greatest enlightenment, Da Yuan Man. So these are all of the ten Da's, I think I got them all, and each day we will be focusing on creating greater uh, purification in releasing the blockages in these key attribute virtue areas. Because if we are not enhancing our life by removing the blockages that keep us from greatest humility or the, the ones that keep us from the greatest service to humanity, the ones that keep us from having the greatest passion, if compassion, if we are not clearing these blockages, then obviously we are not having flourishing in our life. So the purpose of the Soul of Our Matter book was not so people could get rich, no. It was so that people could remove the blockages in their life so that they have the greatest of all aspects that life can offer them. And where there are blockages, things will of course become easier. That is the purpose of each of these 10 days. So let us start by connecting heart to heart, soul to soul. I want to further acknowledge Suki for coming. Thank you, Suki. Uh, thank you, Connie. Great to see you. And Monica. Love if all of you would uh, hit your share button, let other people know that we're live right now. And maybe we'll have a few other people come in that can enjoy the benefits of today's healing, blessing, and teachings. So we're going to connect, <coughs> placing our hands in the soul light, soul service, hand position. Dear Divine, dear Tao, dear Source, dear my spiritual teacher and father, Master Shah, I love you, honor you, appreciate you, respect you, and I bow down to you. I ask for your presence here today to bless all those on the line, all those watching, all those that will listen to this in the future, all those that in any way, shape, or form wish to enhance their vibratory frequency, align their soul, heart, mind, and body to the divine, and increase abundance in every aspect of their life. I ask uh, very deeply that you please assist me and borrow my mouth, allow me to speak your teachings, your wisdom, your truth, and your practices in the highest and best way to bring the greatest value to all those souls in the line. Dear the Source Soul Song of Love, Peace and Harmony, transmitted to all souls in all universes, we love you, honor you, respect you. Please turn on, and as we chant Love, Peace and Harmony, please serve all souls in all universes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So everybody close your eyes. If you don't know the song, just receive the blessing of the chanting and the rest can chant along. Lula, Lula, Lee. 
had some new folks joining us. I want to acknowledge them. Emily He, Rianne, Kristen Darling, Kristen Strachan, Johnny, Pat. Um, thank you all. Stephanie Cannon has joined us. Um, Connie and Kathy Campbell, Crystal, uh, Stefan Dorman, and Robin Rice, Master Robin, uh, Halen. Great to see everybody. Thank you again so much for joining everybody. So I'm very excited about today because it launches the next 10 days of the 10 Da's. To be able to each day to put a focused intention on clearing our own Shen, Qi and Jing blockages that we can align our soul, heart, mind and body to the divine that we can clear that which inhibits us from having the greatest flourishing in our life is truly a blessing. And the greatest blessing is that we have the ability to access this wisdom and technology today. Now, my first encouragement to everybody is to go out and get this book, Soul Over Matter. If everybody new that doesn't have it, get it. Um, I, I, I'm not even going to tell you, think about getting it. As Master Shah would say, do it. Why does he say it like that? Because he knows it will change your life. That's why you do it. Uh, in here, there are two very special calligraphies. Now, these are not normal calligraphies, and now is not the time to give you teaching on it. This first one is called Da Ai. And the one in the back side of it is called Da Quan Shu, Greatest Love and Greatest Forgiveness. Now, in these calligraphies, has, power has been transmitted. I will be using these to trace and bless all of you a little bit later today as we move through some of the practices. And you will be doing your own uh, service with me today as we chant along. <clears throat> so I want to start by, um, by reading uh, something directly from Master Shah's books. And as he goes through the, the other nine da's, it's pretty smooth, but the first one, he bounces around a little bit, so I have to kind of, to present it most effectively, I'll be bouncing around a little bit as well, so bear with me. Okay. So, first is the definition. Da I. Love melts all blockages and transforms all life. As you chant the sacred mantra, Da I, close your eyes. Visualize the greatest love from heaven and source, from heaven's saints and from your own Jing, Qi, and Shen. For those that are new, Jing, Qi, and Shen, uh, Jing is matter, Qi is energy. You've heard of Tai Chi and Qi Gong, so Qi is energy. Jing is matter, Jing, Qi, Shen. Shen is soul, heart, and mind. So soul, heart, mind, energy, and matter. Those are the things that are becoming transformed because those are our base uh, of all life. Yong Shin Yang Nyan. Yong means use. Shin means heart. Yang Nyan means chant. Yong Shin Yang Nyan means use your heart to chant. Master Shah teaches one of the four powers. Uh, body power, mind power, sound power, which is what he's referring to now, and soul power. So sound power is mantra. Um, when we truly bring our heart and we chant with our heart, the effectiveness is dramatically enhanced. That's what he is sharing with us here. The ancient pearl wisdom teaches us that to chant with our hearts and from our hearts to use our hearts to chant is 
ten times more powerful than not using our heart to chant. It is to become what you chant. Apply this ancient sacred wisdom. Okay? So, I will teach a little bit more on the wisdom of Da I. This is from page 87 of this book. Da means greatest. I means love. Da I means greatest love. Love melts all blockages and transforms all life. Every human needs love. This is flowed information. I want you to know I'm reading not what Master Shah thought of was his mind and contemplated and changed the sentence five times. He literally flowed this entire book in a very, very short period of time. So listen with your heart as well. When you feel love from your parents, when you feel love from your colleagues, when you feel love from your partner, when you feel love from your children, when you feel love from your spiritual fathers or mothers, you are moved and touched. Da I is the number one principle to transform your finances, your business. If everyone in a company could apply love towards each other, transformation of the company's finances would be beyond comprehension. Learn and do the soul over matter practices of Da I. When you are ready, share the practices with your colleagues and your employees. You could also share the practices with your family and friends. Da I is not only to transform your finances and business, it is the greatest healer to heal all kinds of sicknesses, including sicknesses in the physical body, emotional body, mental body, and spiritual body. Da I can transform all kinds of relationships. Da I can open one's heart and soul. Da I, greatest love, can increase wisdom and intelligence. Da I can open one's spiritual channels. Da I can transform all life. In this book, we focus on transforming finances and business, but understand that the wisdom of soul over matter practices of the ten da qualities are the nature of heaven and source. The ten da qualities will serve you in every aspect of life, including health, relationship, finances, intelligence, and spiritual journey, and it will bring success in every aspect of your life. All right, so <clears throat> what we're going to do now is we're going to do a practice. Now, this is something that you can and should do by yourself. Very easy to repeat. Something that if you have children, great thing to do with the children. If you have difficulty with the spouse, the boss, the husband, the wife. If you have some serious blockages in your life, health issues, this applies. Greatest love is original source. So when we chant using the, the mantra, which carries power, and we use the other three powers for a total of four powers, then we can make a significant difference in transforming the different aspects of our life. So first, choose an area in your life that you would like to receive transformation in. Tell the divine, dear God, I am deeply honored and grateful for this opportunity to ask for your guidance and blessings. Please bless me for, and then choose your area. So wherever you're at, if possible, sit up straight, back away from the back of the chair, placing your hands over your lower abdomen. You can, not a bad idea to place one hand over your heart center, one hand over your lower abdomen. If that's uncomfortable, you can place them both over your lower abdomen. So that is your body power, okay? For mind power, you're going to visualize golden light coming into your heart center, coming from 365 degrees through earth, through heaven, in all different directions. For the chanting power, we're going to chant Da I. D A A I is the spelling of it. Da I. <coughs> if you have this book, open up to the Da I calligraphy. If you have any of Master Shah's calligraphy book, open it to the Da I calligraphy. If you do not, you would keep your eyes closed, visualizing. Um, and for those that do have the book, they would, of course, trace. Now, we're going to trace for each other. We're not going to trace for ourselves because the highest service is when we serve other people. 
we don't care about ourselves, we don't take care of ourselves, then we let the divine take care of us, we take care of other people. That's not to say we don't feed ourselves and do the common sense things, but when it comes to the opportunity to serve, and we have suffering in a particular area, always better to serve others in that particular area. The more uh, selfless we are, the better the results. Okay? So now we connect with what's called soul power. So everybody repeat after me. Dear Divine, dear Tao, dear Source, dear Master Shah, dear the soul of Da I, greatest love, the countless blessings, saints, saints animals, temple souls, treasures in the Da I calligraphy. We love you, we honor you, we appreciate you. Could you please go out to serve all those that are suffering from the same condition that I am asking for? I will chant for them. So if you ask for financial blessings, then you chant to serve others that are in financial difficulties. We're going to chant Da I. You're visualizing golden light in your heart center. You can also visualize other people who need money receiving it, who need flourishing, need food receiving it. Very simple visualizations. Okay? So, let us begin. I will also chant and trace at the same time. For those that do not have this, keep your eyes closed and visualize. Let us begin. Die, 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 Love, great 
greatest love, greatest love. Die, 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 die. For those that have just joined us, keep your eyes closed. Focus on your heart center. Request a blessing from the Divine. But as you chant along with me, chant to serve others that are in need of the same thing you are requesting. Die, 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 greatest love, greatest love, greatest love, greatest love, greatest love. I die, 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 greatest love, greatest love. Greatest love, greatest love, greatest love. <clears throat> I will ask my soul to continue to trace on your behalf while I do a soul reading. Continue to receive, continue to trace, continue to chant silently. You are all very blessed. This one, Master Paul, has chosen a special Soul Over Matter book that has received the Creator Jindan transmitted to the Da'ai calligraphy. This Creator Jindan has the unique ability to metamorphize to the request of choice. Each of your requests is being directly, positively impacted. Some have requested for their children. Some have requested for their heart. Most have requested for their finances. A few for other health issues. 
as more watch this in the future, there will be requests for relationships and business. This creator Jindan in the greatest love calligraphy has the unique ability to put forth into your Shen, Qi and Jing new messages, the kind of messages that create shift, the kind of messages that wash over and wash away all those things that are negative that have impacted you negatively from achieving your intention. The kind of power that has been <coughs> and is currently being sent to you would take the average person at least 10 hours of meditation to initiate, let alone actually cause benefit from. <coughs> As the hundreds of millions of golden light spheres that have subdivided and come to each of you and has traversed the space in your bodies, there are also many other souls that have been impacted because of those on the line who have selfless service. If you ask for finances, and you requested for others, they have also been positively impacted. There are a few that are living on the street that have awoken and are now currently walking. They are walking to get help for themselves instead of wallowing into the dust. There are some who are now being fed that before had no food. There are some with health issues per your request whose current conditions are slowly being reversed. This is the nature of the universe. Do not be surprised by this communication. When you ask unconditionally to serve others, then that is the greatest service and the greatest response from heaven. Legions of teams in heaven are enacted to follow through with this request for several reasons. One is it is initiated through the one known as Master Shah who has initiated power into the calligraphy which has the transmission of heavens, animals, saints and teams. The second is your intention to serve unconditionally. This combination is rare indeed and it is highly suggested that you continue through each of these 10 days and forever with this practice as it will serve you forever. This is the soul of the Tenda practice. How? Dai 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 Greatest Love Greatest Love Greatest love, greatest love, greatest love, greatest love, greatest love. 
greatest love, greatest love, greatest love. Die, 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 Continue to visualize all those souls that you are serving. What is your focus upon? What did you ask for? Serve the other souls for the same request. See the golden light balls spinning in their bodies, bringing to them what you had asked for. See them smiling see them in gratitude, see their conditions changing for the better. Be grateful that you have this unique and powerful opportunity to serve others with this practice and know that your needs are automatically taken care of. Die, 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 Greatest love, greatest love, greatest love, greatest love, greatest love. Thank you, thank you. So let us bow our head nine times to Divine, to Tao, and to Source, to Master Shah, to all the blessings that we have received at this time through this service of the Da'ai, Greatest Love. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So welcome to everybody new that has come on. You came in in the middle of a huge blessing of Da'ai using the new Soul Over Matter book and the calligraphy and the creator Jindan that was transmitted to this book. This was to serve you and your request. And so we've had some tremendous, tremendous blessings. <clears throat> so please at this time share. I got hot within about one minute of starting the chanting. I'm in an air-conditioned room and I got a fan on me and I was fine until I started the chanting and I have been sweating profusely ever since. Um, so great and tremendous purification has been happening for me. But I'd like to know, and other people uh, that are watching would like to know what your benefits were. Did you feel vibration? Did you feel a heart opening? When you saw who you were serving, how did that feel to you? <coughs> Please state any of your guidance and insights uh, and the value for yourself. Okay? I'm going to go back to Master Shah's book while you are preparing to type that. And um, teach just a little bit more from his book. 
He says that light is one of the most powerful spiritual healings from heaven and from source. You can visualize golden or rainbow light and there is no time limit to a practice of this nature. When you are chanting Da I or any of the ten Da's, or we'll actually be working with some different mantras from this book, where what you are doing is you can literally impact anything. According to Master Shah, he's saying that some silver matter practitioners who chant for two hours or more per day to self-heal chronic and life-threatening conditions. So if anybody's watching and they have some serious conditions, then more is better. I wish you and every reader would chant longer than just the suggested seven minutes. The more you chant, the more benefits you could receive. Now, for those of you that are a little bit newer to um, the healing that comes with Dr. and Master Shah's books, he has been transmitting power into his books for uh, over 10 years now and it has not stopped and we are so blessed because books will last a long long time and they can serve so many people in humanity into these calligraphies are some of the highest powers that have been transmitted and so when you receive the calligraphies or the opportunity to receive the book there's a way in which you can do what's called tracing and it's what I was doing I put my fingers together like this I touched all five of them together okay and each finger represents an element, earth, wood, fire, metal, water. And so you put them together and you put it right on or just barely above the paper. And so this is what I was doing for you. The Shen Qi and Jing of, the, of heaven, of source, of Tao, has been placed into these calligraphies. And so by putting your fingers in this way, you're bringing balance to your five elements and you're as close as possible to that Shen Qi and Jing power. If you want to know if a pear is sweet, then you must taste it. If you want to know if this really works, then give it the amount of time that's necessary. You know, if you have a condition, sit down, uh, connect, and then do the tracing 10, 15, 20, 30 minutes. You'll definitely feel some benefits. So let's see what some of the responses were so far. Elizabeth Folk said she's a feeling of lightness. And welcome, Maria. Sorry that your son woke you up, but so happy to see you. Um, and she said her heart is beating really fast. Kathy Campbell has said she felt much joy and warmth. Wonderful sharing. Raul, as I went into the experience, I became more open and energized. Once I felt a connection to others, I felt intense energy and tears of joy. Wow, wonderful sharing, Raul. Thank you so much. And then Kathy says she felt a powerful yet quiet joy. I was curious. So two people felt this great joy. And that is, that is what resides underneath our heart of blockages. So Monica's response, Da got in Master Paul and Master Shah uh, and all that came. I saw golden and people receiving golden hearts that was bringing more light for their request. It was truly beautiful. So the golden hearts also. It was beautiful. Thank you for sharing. And then Bonnie says, I focused on serving others. One in particular came to mind and channeled purposely to this person to receive divine healing then focused on golden light, a uh, golden ball of light beaming at this time. I felt calm and at ease. Thank you so much for sharing, Bonnie. <coughs> and welcome, Lopez. And Yvonne shares, I'm tracing and silent chant and I too <coughs> from her Soul Over Matter book and to all who has financial difficulties and struggle to awake herself. Thank you, Yvonne. This is the key. And then Helen uh, Libre says, Thank you, Master Paul. I'm supposed to be my friends, but they are all late for a very good reason. Her heart was here with the eye and expanding. I truly appreciate all of your sharing. Um, I want to offer a flow at this time from the soul of the eye, greatest love, so that we can have a deeper understanding of the power and significance of this first of the ten das. These ten das. A da, da means greatest. It is truly, truly important that we recognize these ten da's as a um, literally a signpost stepping stones to teach our children. Who would not want to teach their children greatest love, 
greatest forgiveness, greatest compassion, greatest light, greatest humility, greatest harmony, greatest gratitude, greatest flourishing, greatest service, and greatest enlightenment. There is nothing there that is not of the greatest value to our children. That's why these have been brought to earth at this time through our spiritual teacher, Master Shah. So I encourage you to learn more about these 10 Da's over these next days. Uh, so Suki responded, uh, her heart is full of happiness. Thank you. Mel Gittin says, I felt very calm and kept seeing roses open up inside a brighter light and wrapped around my mother. Wonderful. Great sharing. And Helen continues to respond, her heart and I expanded the wrath of Shen Chi Jing and she was planning to expand it more. Wonderful. Okay, let me do a flow from Da Ai. <clears throat> the words, the things, the phrases, if you will, that you use are representative of but one percent of all that I am. What is Da Ai? Da I is the greatest love. Why is Da I important? I am the greatest love. All that is is the greatest love. For you to align to all that I am is of the greatest urgency for you, for all souls, for all life. This is of the greatest urgency especially at this time because there is so much separation from love. It brings great pain to watch one turn against another because of the pain they are in. To take another's life because of being so lost from all that I am. It is love that heals all things. This has been said many times before. But even this is difficult to truly comprehend at the level that it is meant to be. When the total focus in this and all existence is love, then this and all existence can be of the highest vibratory rate that there is nothing left but the pureness of Creator. Our part, your part, in this grand play is to be the instigator of the greatest love, to be the model by which everyone else follows. Start with yourself. Be the greatest love to yourself. Be the greatest love for yourself. Be the model by which your children copy. Because it is the lack of self-love that is the initiator of separation from my original self. Love yourself first. Love your children next. Love the divine as always. As you become that which is your original creation, you will fully and completely engulf yourself in the flourishing that has been meant for you in all time. Any lack of any kind in any manner is a direct relation to separation from me, from love, from your source and your creation. These are my words to you on this day. Please pay attention to them and make them a part of your beingness. This is the soul of Da Ai, greatest love. How, 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 thank you, thank you, thank you, beloved Da Ai. Very, very pure and beautiful soul. Okay. So we have a few more sharings. Uh, Kristen said, my 10-year-old grandson, uh, granddaughter, insisted that I write down the 10 Da's so that she could memorize them. And we meditate together and she said that she felt like it was all very familiar to her. I believe it, yeah, the original 10 Da's. 
Okay. So we're coming up near the end of the hour. Now one of the things that I wanted to make available to everybody through the next 10 days, each day I will be teaching on the 10 DAS. Tomorrow we will be focusing on the greatest forgiveness. As we focus on these different aspects of these spiritual virtues, there will always be opportunity to purify just by being here, just by serving others. I want to make available to whoever has interest in it a crown chakra blessing. There will be a crown chakra blessing for each of the ten das. A crown chakra blessing is through a divine channel such as myself and I will I can do this in person or remotely and it will be a two minute blessing in which the divine delivers to you to your soul that particular virtue all of us need more of greatest love for example some of us have difficulty with forgiveness so you might have a greater need for example of um, Da Quan Shu greatest forgiveness of course when we get to Da Chang Sheng greatest flourishing I suspect that will be a very popular one but each one we have blockage areas in and as I go through the next nine days feel which one or more might be of value to you. So a crown chakra blessing will be available for each soul. Um, there are only $100 honor fee and you can message me through Facebook if that's of interest to you. I will keep it open for um, for of course the full 10 days of the 10 DAS and at the end of those 10 days I will check how long uh, have them allow me to keep it open okay so it is my greatest honor to serve all of you it is my greatest pleasure to serve all of you uh, we have one of the universal servants Kristen she's been just wonderful helping me uh, in so many ways I hope that she's able to um, type out the flow and that should be made available to you as well um, if you are not familiar with my live stream you can hit the follow button in the right hand corner and then know when I go live and also above my image here is information on my website and whatnot. So I love you all. I thank you so much for coming. I thank you so much for sharing all of this. And I will see you tomorrow where we focus on greatest forgiveness. We'll see you then. Bye-bye.